So here it is, home sweet home for two and a half years and often the Sukkot uh, non-permanent shelter that we stay in. Uh, you notice all this plastic up top. It, the roof is terrible about leaking, not unlike many other RVs and trailers. And so we've decided to do a more permanent solution to the problem. And so if you see here, this is Pastor Joe Fox. Hi. He always hires out his hard work to other people. He's just doing this as a demonstration in the I video. I what you've already done. So the hired help did that. <laughs> all right, there. If you see the ends, they're all black. It's from this roofing cement. Roofing tar. Right? Tar, whatever it's called right here. It's, it's, it's a delightful mix of gooey and, and muddy looking. And it's got the viscosity of, say... Almost dry peanut cement, <laughs> peanut butter. These are uh, these four by fours are actually treated for in-ground contact. Some aren't. These are for in-ground contact. But I got this idea on somebody else's YouTube video. I wish I could give him credit. And he did this when he was doing a deck. And I said, you know what? Let's just go through that extra step and uh, really make them impervious. So that's what we're doing now. And let's see the utensils you're using for this f fine work. Very expensive utensils. Uh, this is a particular brand of Shofar Mountain Stirrer Stick. Yes. Right here. And then uh, this is one of the very expensive brushes that you can get at Lowe's. And so... It's kind of like putting the barbecue sauce on the chicken. Yeah, kind of like that. You just kind of goop it on there. And you actually did a better job at your ends than I'm doing. You made them look really nice, so I'm going to try and do that. And then after we get those poles up, we will build a, uh, a roof over top of this because the trailer inside is actually pretty nice. It's got a working stove and... Sink and shower. Yeah, well... <laughs> <laughs> the, they have no water running to them, but they drain out and like the bed in there is in good shape, the bench and everything, and it's got nice uh, storage. So instead of just trashing this thing, it's, it's, it makes more sense to get use out of it. And so we're going to put this, uh, this roof up for it, keep the rain off of it, and also add extra shade to it in the yeah, summer. Yeah, make it cooler in the summertime too. And these poles and the, the supplies and stuff Rhonda. were brought to you by two saints, Tom Fowler and Rhonda Holt. They, Tom Fowler's going to, his contribution is going to do the actual metal sheeting. Mm-hmm. So th thank you, saints, for, for donating to these projects. And we're working on them. All right. Shalom. I'll see you out there.